Hey, what's up, everyone? How you doing? It's uh, me, Mr. 4K Upscaler. So, recently there was a uh, 4K gameplay footage released of Microsoft Flight Simulator 2020 uh, that's coming out on Xbox One X and PC Windows next year, 2020. And uh, what you're looking at here is the uh, pre-alpha footage that was uh, taken from Microsoft Studios game studios and uh, what's so unique about this game is not only is it state-of-the-art graphics I mean they're using DirectX 12 state-of-the-art graphics but what's also interesting is that nothing here it's modeled like the, the city the terrain it is not modeled by developers they're using the Azure a satellite to map automatically the terrain, the buildings, the roads, everything you see here, it's being rendered by satellite. So what you're basically seeing here, it looks exactly like if you go to Berlin, to fly over Berlin, you're going to see exactly what you uh, would normally see if you were to fly a plane in Berlin. Same thing in, um, in LA or Paris or Tokyo or any of these cities or LA New York so you would see exactly what you would see in real life as you are flying and I think this is the uh, the important aspect of this game not only are you getting uh, photorealistic graphics that's number one with 4k native 4k and HDR at 60 FPS but at the same time you are getting a detailed realistic cities and countries and continents everything scanned by a satellite geography it's being scanned by satellite so everything it's being uh, calculated and rendered automatically on whatever satellite depicted so I don't know how they did this I don't know what kind of technology they're using. I just know it's Azure, but uh, the whole process of how they did this and how they rendered this with a um, computer and what kind of engine they used to do this, uh, it's simply amazing. Uh, and of course, this game's gonna look stunning when it comes out on Xbox Scarlet. You know, Xbox Scarlet's gonna give us uh, this. Is, uh, you're gonna get a photorealistic game I think this will be one of the very first photorealistic games that's gonna be out there uh, with Xbox Scarlet and of course if you have a PC real-time ray tracing and all that other stuff obviously with a PC you're gonna be able to enjoy this as well you know um, I'm gonna listen I'm gonna try both I'm gonna try the uh, the Scarlet version and uh, the PC version obviously but I think with the PC version, you're going to have a much better deal because you can use the flight stick, yoke, yoke stick, and it's going to be a much, I think, better experience. But either way, I mean, look at this. This is just stunning, man. Uh, when you look at this footage, when you look at this game, and what they're able to achieve. This is photo. This is photorealistic. I mean, um, I don't know how else to say it, guys. You know. I mean, how much more photorealistic do you want it to get? If you take a, a real-life photo, it's going to look exactly like this. It's going to look exactly like this. Uh, so this is this is going to be pro this no not probably this is the most realistic flight simulator period, and and uh, this is going to be like a love letter to aviators. If you're uh, someone who's in aviation who loves flying who is a pilot uh, this game it's going to be a love letter to aviation okay and um, it just looks uh, ridiculously stunning uh, yeah this is all rendered by satellite Azure obviously everything is using a high textures but the developers did not model every in each building this was all the terrain and the building and areas was all rendered by 
satellite like geography has been scanned around the world so what you see on the ground is what you would see in real life and then when you add the real-time weather also scanned by the satellite and the clouds are being rendered by the uh, exactly in real time as you are playing this game I believe that's gonna be online you're gonna be have to be connected online for that but that's gonna make it even more like bananas realistic uh, so yeah this is gonna be and then you add native 4k and HDR um, yeah uh, well, I mean, I think, like, it, look, I, I said this from beginning. This will be a uh, love letter to uh, aviators. It's, this is going to be the most realistic flight simulator ever created. It's going to put X-Plane 11 to shame. No one's going to even touch X-Plane 11. Really, I mean, like, eh, why even bother? Seriously. When you have this, uh, and then you can play it on your TV, on your OLED uh, and uh, yeah and it's it's really gonna show off what Scarlet can do so I really can't wait this this I'm more excited about this game next year with Scarlet than I am about Halo Infinite I mean don't get me wrong I, I'm I mean I am looking forward to Halo Infinite but I'm really really looking forward to this uh, this is just uh, simply mind-blowing uh, you guys can check out this video for yourself if you want. I'll leave a link down below. Check it out. But um, I'm telling you, uh, there's nothing quite like it. I mean, this is super photorealistic. And um, can't wait to play it, man. I think you guys will agree that this is just simply uh, amazing. So, um, yeah. I mean, look at this. I mean, what else do you want me to say? Uh, it's crazy. And I'm not even recording this in a native 4K. I'm, I'm, I'm compressing this so I can save the space on the hard drive so it can upload faster. But if you see this footage on your OLED with 4K and HDR, with a, with a, if, you see, if you get a direct source of this footage and you play it on your OLED or your QLED, in 4k HDR you're just gonna be uh, blown away just how realistic this is so I can't wait I really can't wait well anyway there you have it guys I hope you enjoyed this video and uh, just want to do a short video on this to let you know what I think and uh, it's just bananas you know <laughs> as you can see clearly you can see that it looks look at this I mean look at this tell me if that's not amazing like I said this is a love letter to aviators if you're a pilot this is a love letter to you you're gonna you're gonna just simply indulge and love this game period there you go it's crazy